Hi everyone, welcome back to Aphrodite, Ben and Neil Cherry. Thanks very much for joining our channel today. It is very much appreciated. Um, got a request to do Scorpio uh, female and Taurus male. Um, please only take what resonates and leave the rest. Don't make a story if it's not your story. This is not in any way a personal reading, but a little bit of guidance to what may be happening uh, around you. Okay, all right. The thing is, um, Scorpio, that Taurus is is the, your opposite sign, and not that, in well, in my books, it shouldn't have a, a great deal to do with anything other than um, things that are missing in your life they provide, and the things that are missing in their life you provide. Okay, uh, but there is a lot of similarities, but you know, with the Taurus, Taurus male especially, um, if they're not, you know, like educated and 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 um, shown the way at a young age that can be the very opposite of everything okay um so yeah i do feel like that you do get along to a certain point okay right. have a few more cards for taurus and scorpio scorpio and taurus Can I have one more, please? Get you. Interesting. All right. Scorpio and Taurus. All right. They will push everything to the limit with you, but uh, if you resist and stand up to them, you can win their heart. Uh, a little bit of narcissistic, selfish, unwelcome to marriage, constantly uh, courting, loves to be praised. Okay. This person has a little bit of an ego, um, but... You can resist, um, you know, like their, their way, you know, I don't know what I'm trying to tell you. Okay, so um, they will push you, you know, to the limit. Um, but if you resist it and, and stand up to them, um, you will win their heart because they'll see that you're a strong person, not easily pushed around, that you can put up with their stupidity, I'm going to say. <laughs> okay, all right. But anyway... Um, there will be great success immediately followed by great joy. Uh, turning events into good um, re resolution of difficulties. Um, look, whatever is going on between this couple here, Scorpio and, and Taurus, there is a solution that you can fix this situation, okay? Um, it is a matter of, like, um, finding your strength to basically... Um, you know, keep going with the relationship, even though it has its ups and downs, but you are winning over this person, um, you know, and, you know, people, like, I, I feel like there's a little bit of jealousy because this person sees that people like to talk to you, they like to be with you, they like to, um, you know, listen to you and, and you know, you're, you've got you've got friends where, um, they're feeling a little bit left out in that in that area. So there is a little bit of jealousy towards you there, Scorpio. Uh, you will be deceived and betrayed by someone you love, though. If someone wants to harm you, you will feel a sense of revenge. Interesting. All right. The end of everything and conclusion. If the four cards surround it are uh, negative, um, this card signifies that there is an ending to a relationship, Okay. I have to pull out another two or three cards. But, you know, however this relationship started off, um, it started off really well. Um, where it is currently, it's like somebody has deceived you, Scorpio. You know, they've betrayed you. All right. A deep and great secret that soothes the soul. Re uh, revelation of life secret enrichment of the soul. There is some truth you're going to find out. True and great love. Okay. All right. All right. Hope you're not pregnant. Yeah, look. This reading is a little bit all over the place. I don't know if you have a child to this person or you will fall pregnant because I'm not sure how old you are or what your situation is. But 
the relationship has its ups and downs, definitely. And at times you feel like you can't trust this person. At times you feel like there's other people that are interfering, okay? And I feel like this person, what they do is they see that you get a lot of attention, not that you ask for it, but you do get some sort of attention from people. That makes them a little bit jealous, okay? Because this person does love you and they do want to have a child with you if you don't have one yet, okay? Um... But the opportunity is going to open up, okay, and um, the path to success is going to open up and you will be filled with with a lot of experiences. There's a lot of boredom right now, okay, in this situation. Um, really, it's a matter of like being on the same page with this person. Um, but because I feel both of you like your, your, your focus is somewhere, their focus is somewhere else, okay. Um, and it depends what kind of a Taurus they are. If they're an educated Taurus, they have a good job, whatever. Um, this, this is a family man. This is somebody who will want to grow with you, okay? If they're not, this is a person that will just take you around in circles, even though they care, you will never have any more than what you have now, okay? It will always be you pushing Scorpio. It will always be you that's, that's trying to succeed for more and more and more, okay? Um, well, that's what these cards are indicating, but let's have a look here what they're indicating. Right? Tell me about Taurus and Scorpio. Tell me about Scorpio and Taurus. Luck is on your side with this person, Scorpio. Um, I don't know if you're married, but somebody's intention is to take you away and, you know, have this honeymoon period with you. Yeah. Manifest what you want, Scorpio. I don't know, it seems to be a concern about somebody's sexuality. Someone's still trying to figure themselves out. And I'm telling you now, it's not a personal reading, just let me take what resonates because I don't want anybody, like, you know, <laughs> worried about something that they're not supposed to be worried about. Okay, so someone's got their eye on you. Um, somebody is watching you, trying to work you out. This could be you trying to work out the other person, trying to seek information, okay? All right, so you've come out, uh, Scorpio, as Cancer Scorpio uh, Pisces. Um, you need to get more information regarding this person. You are being, you know, protected right now. Something about a gold digger, okay? This person wants to take you out on a date night. There will be intimacy. They do want a commitment with you. But who's the air sign? Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, okay? Um, something, somebody has to let go of an air, of an air sign, okay? In order for, for this relationship to grow, to grow. Okay, um, there may be some sort of an, an addiction that is going on um, and there may be distance between you and this person emotionally or physically right now um, because it, it was actually not the right time, not the right time because somebody needed to let go of something, but somebody is lying. Okay, be careful of someone's sneaky behavior. All right, so um, I do feel though depending on what kind of a Taurus you're dealing with, because like I said, you get one that's educated and they can they can run their own business, they can make money, they're financially stable. You get one that isn't and they prefer to live the low life, okay, because it's easier than to, to commit. All right, so we've got truth and clarity that's going to be spoken and seen here, okay. What does Taurus want from Scorpio? What does Taurus want from Scorpio? Tell me, Spirit, what does Taurus want from Scorpio? They do want to invest. And they do want to come forward. I think somebody, you know, truth and clarity may want you to leave this situation because you're not getting equal give and take in their secrets. Yeah. 
there is a pregnancy around okay third party so a repeated pattern a repeated pattern yeah this is upsetting it is upsetting you okay we've got to stop there otherwise it's going to go into a personal reading but i wish you all the best scorpio and get your information before you commit to this person because there is something that is hidden all right we'll see you next time thanks for watching bye for now